In the afternoon, Louisville ran for over 200 yards today, but it's another near miss that has the Irish players in agony. Adam Jarangowski has more from Notre Dame Stadium. We've lost back-to-back -back games because we couldn't put down a ball and kick it 32 yards. Saturday's 31-28 loss marks the first time in the Brian Kelly era that the Fighting Irish have lost on senior day. And what was once a promising season has now snowballed into three consecutive losses. We had a chance with the ball in our own hands with, with a minute to go and a chance to win, and, and we got to cash that in and score. It definitely hurts. Uh, I think it hurts more so for the seniors. Uh, my classmates, you know, guys who uh, don't have another year, um, and, you know, that's how they kind of leave. Uh, that's their lasting impression um, at Notre Dame Stadium. What is it, three losses in a row? Yeah. Man. I mean, it's disappointing, but it's just all about, you know, understanding, you know, the uh, the magnitude of, you know, the game that you're playing, you know, especially the place that you're playing at. You just got to get better. You got to find a way. You're going to you're gonna get hit in the face. I mean, there's no doubt about it. Every team faces adversity, and there's no doubt about that our team's facing adversity right now. So it's just how you respond. I just walked around to every one of the players and told them I loved them and, and thanked them because they gave it their all. And I had told them beforehand, you leave your soul on that field. and. There's no regrets, and they did, and I love them for it. A team that was once riding high heading into their Week 8 matchup against second-ranked Florida State now hits the road to take on rival USC with the hopes of avoiding a 7-5 and five season. From Notre Dame Stadium, Adam Darangowski, WSBT 22 Sports. As Adam mentions, the Irish off to the Coliseum to take on the Trojans next week. Right now, USC is getting hammered by their other rival, UCLA, 38-20 in the fourth quarter.